Hello friends, my name is Pastor Alyssa and welcome to our Open Door Church's Children's Time. Our scripture focus today is Luke chapter 19 verses 1 through 10 and so I invite you to read that uh, with your friends or family or guardians or whoever is joining you today and then come back for the rest of this time together. Does anyone know what holiday is coming up tomorrow if you're watching this on the day the video comes out? But what holiday happens on the last day of October? That's right, it's Halloween. Are any of you all getting dressed up for Halloween? Now, Halloween is exciting, right? <laughs> it's something fun that we get to do together, dress up and uh, have fun with one another. Now, just for a moment, I want you to think about the costume you'll be wearing this year and all of the costumes that you have worn on past Halloweens. Can you think of at least one costume that you have worn that you would not want to wear every single day? Is there any costume that you've put on that you wouldn't want to put that costume on every single day? For me, I know when I was growing up, one year I dressed up like Barbie, but it had, the costume had a mask and really uncomfortable shoes and while it was fun to dress up like Barbie for Halloween I wouldn't want to dress up with um, this big mask with little eye holes <laughs> that you could barely see out of every day and really uncomfortable shoes I wouldn't want to wear that every single day one because you know it's not practical I might also feel a little weird if I dressed up looking like Barbie every day. <laughs> It'd make me feel kind of different or like I wouldn't fit in um, at work or maybe you wouldn't fit in at school. I think all of those are good reasons, right? Now, I wanted us to think about something that would make us feel like we were different or like we wouldn't fit in because in today's story we hear about Zacchaeus and he didn't feel like he fit in either. What we learn about Zacchaeus was that he was really small and that he had a job as a tax collector. Does anyone know what being a tax collector meant? It means that it was his job to collect money from his own people and give it to his people's enemy, the Romans. In other words, how he looked and how he acted caused him to feel like he didn't fit in with the people around him. It was sort of like he was walking around in his uncomfortable Halloween costume every day, all day long. It should not be surprising then that Zacchaeus did not want to keep feeling that way, which is why he climbed up the tree in the story to see Jesus. He figured if he was ever going to fit in, Jesus was the one who might help him to do so. Now, do you remember what happened once Zacchaeus saw Jesus? That's right, Jesus invited himself over to Zacchaeus' house. By inviting Zacchaeus to join him for dinner, Jesus was showing him and everyone who was watching that it was okay for Zacchaeus to join in and belong, even if Zacchaeus felt like he was different and didn't fit in. We then see that Zacchaeus was so excited about belonging and about fitting in that he promised to give away half of what he owned. You know, just like Jesus invited Zacchaeus to join him in what he was doing, Jesus also invites us to join him in what he is doing. And when we say yes to Jesus' invitation, just like Zacchaeus did, then we start to experience how we belong to, how we belong to God and how we fit into God's community. The more we experience that belonging 
and fitting in feeling, the more likely we are to invite others to experience the same thing, just like Jesus invited Zacchaeus, which then helps those around us know that they belong to God and are also loved by God. And this is good news for us today as we talk about the uh, theme of worship today, which is seeking acceptance, that we are all uh, children of God and that like the people in the story called to invite one another to come together in community. And so I invite you to join me now in a spirit of prayer. And this is a repeat after me prayer. So we say, dear God, thank you for Jesus who reminds us that we belong to you and to each other. Amen.